Well, what can I say? It was my dad. When I was growing up in Detroit in the late 60s and early 70s, I spent a lot of time watching my dad cut all those heads. At that time, being a kid, I was more interested in the hamburgers that the producers brought in the studio than in the music they were playing. But looking back, though, there was one thing that became the most valuable concept I've ever learned as a musician. Sitting next to Dad, I watched and experienced what feel was about. Sure, he taught me, you know, scales and fingerings and how to read music, but I could have learned that anywhere. Learning how to make the connection between my soul and my instrument came from checking out what my dad and the rest of the musicians my dad called the Funk Brothers were doing. Very few musicians got the opportunity to learn like that, so I consider myself very blessed. Dad always told me, you'd never be me and I'd never be you. So just be yourself and play what you feel. If you don't feel it, don't play it. This is why it sounded pretty simple at the time, but over the years as my career progressed, I've learned to recognize the wisdom in these words. Now let's see what kind of feel I, James Jamerson Jr., can put in my dad's bass lines on Marvin Gaye, What's Going On? I think some of my dad's greatest works came on Marvin Gaye's records, so I'd like to play another cut from one of his early hits, Ain't That Peculiar.
I'd like to play an excerpt from an upright part that Dad played on My Guy by Mary Wells. If the tone sounds familiar, it's because I'm recording with the same instrument that Dad originally used 25 years ago when he cut this song. Mm-hmm. 